Welcome to part number 33 of New for Speed Underground 2. This is the movie Chicane, and today it's time for more Stage 4 events. Nothing else really to say, except let's go drifting. Get back in the heights. Okay, yeah, there's really not much room here to drift, except, oh, Jesus Christ, that was terrible. I must say, right here is an area to get a shit ton of bonus points. Yeah, we lost that big 20,000 point drift, so that's going to hurt us heading to the end of the race. Might have to do a race restart, we don't know yet, we'll see. Okay, I'm in first. Nice. Yes! Saved it. <laughs> Holy crap, that was a shit ton of points, man. Wow. Alright. You know what's time? It's time for thumbnail time. Well, that was easy to catch. Ooh, new suspension parts. Hell yeah. Which, you know what? Uh, there's a bunch of races in the heights. Let's do another drift event, and then... I don't know. We'll play by ear, I guess. Okay, so here we are. The next drift event in Jackson Heights. And, unfortunately, it's a parking lot drift. That sucks. Make us go all the way up there for this event. Kind of weird, but okay. Well, good start, but just not a good finish to that little drift. Well, this trip event's actually pretty close. I think the 206 is in second. He's been closing the gap quite a bit. It's Mark. We'll find out what Mark is driving in a bit. Oh, he barely won that race. Holy crap. Only by 2,000 points. So oh, he's driving a G35. Oh, okay. So he wasn't driving the Pojo. All right. Chrome and Flamin cover. Cool. Chrome and Flamin, need I say more? Just win. You're on the cover. If only it were easy as that. All right. Well, next up, I think, is a sprint race in the parking lot. So let's go ahead and go there. Okay. So we're about to pull up to the parking lot of the observatory. And there's two events here, circuit and sprint. There's a sprint race outside near the mansions. Okay. Uh, this is going to be really tough. So we have to make quick moves here and get to the lead ASAP.
Well then. I mean, okay, just everyone crash in the same traffic car. That's fine with me. I'll take the lead. One part about the Supra that's not good is the handling, and it really shows here in Jackson Heights. For like the future, for stage 5, I think for stage 5 I'm gonna have like a really like planned out set of cars to use for certain events and stuff. I, I don't know. I know it's gonna be really brutal, especially in the Heights. So I have to use like the 240 up here because by the end, the 240 is going to be maxed out, you know, in terms of tuning and whatnot. So it won't really be a concern. Well, at least we have the lead with 40% of the race to go. I rather hit the walls in the cars. Whoa. Okay, he's coming in hot. So let's get the nitrous. No chances taken. There we go. The ultimate way to celebrate a win. Okay, what's next? No new items. All right. Oh, yes. Another short Jackson Heights race. Awesome. It's not that I hate Jackson Heights, I hate the rubber banding up here. It's the worst in the entire game. That's why I want the races to be short. Because, like, if I'm going to just get dominated on and just, you know, lose the entire race, I don't want to lose in a long endurance circuit race, you know? One of these short little circuits is fine with me. I was trying to dump the 3000 GT. That car is being really good up here. Surprisingly. I thought Celico would be the favorite, but nope. 3000 GT has been leading. Now the Celica's leading after I dumped them coming out of that one corner, so I'm surprised by that. Then again, rubber banding. I know that's a word I keep using, but it's the truth. That was really disastrous for both first and second. 
which is me, of course. Alright, final lap. Gotta make sure we don't completely screw up this lap. I mean, I, don't, I do not want to do this race again. Okay, we need to get as much nitrous as possible. I think the Celica is going to make a run for the win. Holy crap, his grip is amazing. Okay, nope, we got him. He left the door open. Damn, trying to give us the bumper to run? Didn't work. Alright, I think that was a lucky win. I thought the Celica had it there, but thankfully we did. That's kind of weird, that pole is just floating in the air. Whatever. Anyways, um, let's go ahead and go to the mansions up here. Because of the sprint race. And what's the sprint race going to be at? I'm pretty sure it's a Jackson Heights race. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, good lord. Please tell me we start in the heights. Okay, well. Heading into Beacon Hills. Alleyway was a disaster. And then. Well, just the rubber banding was stupid in the heights like I predicted. And we're trying this again. Okay, we gotta make sure we don't completely ruin our run again. We crashed into a traffic car around here. Holy crap. Okay, um, that went better than I expected. Because we have one guy going through the tunnel. Oh, he spun. Good. Okay, he just crashed into the pillar. Thanks. Let's play Leapfrog with that other car. Somehow we get wrecked. Excuse me. It's getting late where I'm at. Might be ending my stream soon. Only a few more corners to go. Okay, that's a good way to win. See? Flipping over a truck. 
Oh, it's early morning in Portugal? Got it. Yeah, it's late night here, dude. Okay, well, the special event is this way. Oh, it's just a photo shoot. It couldn't possibly get sweeter than this. You're in the next production. You gotta like that. Let's see here. Um, I kind of want like the palm trees in the front. Like that, yeah, and then. Oh yeah, Speed Demons 3. Sounds like a porn film. Jesus Christ. All right, um, at the bottom of the heights, there's a street cross event and a sprint event. Let's do those. Okay, so here we are, bottom of the hills. Sprint race right here, and it's in the heights, I'm assuming. No, okay. It's kind of an odd location for a race that starts in Beacon Hills and ends in the city center. Whatever. Oh, other way around. Sorry. Well, Selica took himself out. Holy crap. That was really close. A little bit too close for comfort. Damn rubber banding. That was like the perfect way to set him up so I can overtake, put him into a taxi. Once again, celebration by crashing into an innocent pedestrian for no absolute reason. Okay, next, there's a street cross race right around the corner. Well, need I say more about that start? Typical street cross racing. Nothing really else to say. Apart from the fact that I just completely dumped that Eclipse and took the lead. <laughs> yeah, I guess. That's pretty much it right there. That's the best way to celebrate, just crashing to innocent people. Holy crap, the lead is six seconds. What happened?
Seven second victory. That's huge for a street cross event. That's an eternity at this track. Okay, nothing new unlocked. Do we have any more? Okay, there's one circuit race at the end of the heights. We might as well do that one. We're gonna have to anyways, but what I mean is like we might as well do it right now. I have a feeling. I knew it. Oh, I hate this track so much. I hate this race. I hate this race with a burning passion. This is my second attempt on week number two of this fucking race. I haven't tried this race for a whole week straight, but it's been a week since my previous stream where I originally attempted this particular race. So I want to throw that out for clarification, but yeah, this, this race is stupid. Good. If I don't win it in this attempt with the Audi A3, I'm going to go with the 240SX. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, how's that SUV run going, by the way, Pleb King? Hey, Deep War. Uh, how's it going? Escalade still eats other crap in Street Cross. Yeah. I mean, Street Cross is probably going to be the most difficult of the entire freaking game. With an SUV run only. Yeah, see, that, that, that just shows my frustration with these guys. Like, I don't even care about racing clean. See, this is really... Whoa, okay. Like, all I care about is just winning, dude. I guess this is good practice. This is kind of good practice for um, the final lap, I suppose. Me just ramming my way into victory, you know? Final lap. Oh, stage Cree. Stage Cree. Stage 3 is quite struggle with an SUV. You're afraid of Street Cross in Stage 4 and 5? Oh boy. <laughs> oh, what about GT Sport? You talking about the new update? That new update is sick. Oh, yes. <laughs> the gramming is good practice for the last lap. Oh, hell yeah. It is good practice for GT Sport. New strategy. Every time I'm about to do a near miss, hit the nitrous so that way I can use some of the nitrous and then get it back. 
I think that's a good plan. To try to stretch out this lead as much as possible without the rubber banding interfering. Let's hope we, this doesn't jinx me, Pleb. They are. Get out of here, Mazda. Well, I don't know. It's it's a YouTube thing, I guess, dude. Nothing I can do about that. Got to be extra careful here. The Mustang and the 206 are coming in hot. Let's get on the nitrous. Oh, finally, 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 dude. Oh my god, that took way too long. Seriously, that took way too long, dude. Oh my god, I hate this track. I hate this damn track so much. I don't care about my rep points. Hey, I with her. Good, how are you? Sorry I didn't read your comment, dude. Okay, so... Yeah, finally, we win that race. What do we have left? We have... Three circuit races, four drag races, one sprint race, and then, yeah, URL stuff. So, next video on NFS Underground 2, we're going to be doing the rest of the regular world map events.